Now, I remember when I first started in the whole working world, I had to uh, apply for a job. And my first job that I applied to was at pet care. And I knew nothing about pets. And I remember walking in nervously and I was like, uh, I'm looking for a job. And they gave me this uh, three page um, booklet to fill out in bubble sheet. I never really applied to that job fully because I realized that wasn't my passion. Um, fast forward, I was able to land a job at Capriati's, then at Wilmington University, then at Microsoft. So throughout the years, I applied through different things. Some things I got, some things I didn't, but at least I applied. So when searching and applying for a job, it's very difficult to put who are you on a sheet of paper? I know that has been a challenge for me to figure out, well, how do I talk myself up when I am writing a resume? What skills do I have? When I started out, I didn't have a job skill. So what things can I fill in that um, can, can really tell about me? Volunteer experience is one. Maybe I worked for a family friend or I started my own side business uh, with a lemonade stand. Something like that. How can we build and talk each other up uh, in your resume? Well, we're going to be learning all about that today. But I want to pose a question uh, for you. If you were trying to get a job, what do you think the most important thing an employer will want to know about you? Everyone has a special skill and ability and what makes them unique. So really, let's think about how can we make that shine and come out. You know, what would I want an employer to know about me? Well, one, I want them to know that I am very creative. I'm willing to help uh, people out. And I also volunteer. I love helping out my community uh, and my church. Um, these are the things that I might want to share with my employer. Teamwork. I love working together as a team. I love to think outside the box and being creative. These are the things that I actually tell my employer at Microsoft. When I was applying for a job to do like marketing and creativity and demos, I really express like, hey, I love doing demos. I had some samples that I could share with them, but I really talk that up. And I talk about things that I do in my off time, uh, side business, photography, those things. So try to figure out ways to talk yourself up, figure out what is it that you do that you are passionate about and let your employers know that can help you advance in the career that you want to get into and apply to where you want to go and see how are you going to make an impact in this world. Apply, build, create a legacy. Don't be shy. Personally, I'm shy, but you got to step out there. So make sure you have your resume. Write down those skills. Volunteer in your community if you can. Those are the things that's really going to make your resume stand out. And one thing I want to say, if you don't have a resume on you right now, if you don't have anything, maybe start a LinkedIn profile. I have one. It's free and I enjoy it. I get to build a community with people that I know. Make sure if you do have a profile, add the people that you know. See what they're doing in their community. Build that professional network. I truly love to hear your stories on how you are applying yourself. And I hope everyone achieves their goals and dreams.